Hello guys, this is a very short tutorial to show you how to install Steam Deck Windows Controller Driver, short name as SWICD. The Steam Deck Windows Controller Driver is the second method that will make the Steam Deck building controller work with any no Steam games. If you want to use the Glossy's method, you can check out this video on my channel. Personally, I prefer SWICD method now, since it will allow you to use the Steam Deck building touchpad as a mouse function. The Glossy's method will disable the touchpad feature, but it is your call to choose which one to use. I have both Glossy's and SWICD on my Steam Deck currently. I will just quickly demonstrate the issue that we will have if the Steam Deck Windows controller driver is not installed yet. I have this Tunic game on my desktop. This is not a Steam game. Let's run this game without SWICD installed. So the Steam Deck building controller is not working at all right now. That means we are not able to control any no Steam games on Steam Deck right now. I have to use keyboard to close this game at this moment. Now let's start our tutorial and fix this problem. Step 1. Go to this website. The website link is available under my video description. Once you get here, just download the first three softwares. I will just speed up the downloading process here. Make sure you click keep the file at here, and then select keep anyway. Now we should have three softwares here. Just go ahead and install them. Make sure follow my installation order, the SWICD driver should be the last one to install. There is no need to reboot the Steam Deck now, just click no here. That's all we need to do. Let's go to the desktop and make sure your Steam client is running. Let's open USB game controller on Windows. We can see there is no controller is detected right now. But the magic will happen once you double click the SWICD driver on the desktop. The Steam Deck building controller now is detected as Xbox 316 controller by Windows now. We can see the SWICD driver is running correctly and the emulation states is active too. Now go to setting and make sure you check those two boxes. Enable start with windows. Also check enable start minimized. Then go to default profile. Make sure you check mouse movement disabled and also check the button disabled. Now let's run the tunic game again and see how it goes. The Steam Deck controller is now working perfectly fine with no Steam games. Also, the Steam Deck touchpad is also working as a mouse, even the SWICD driver is running. In order to make the SWICD is running correctly, please make sure you have the Steam client is always running at background. By the way, if that was really useful what I just shared with you, then I would love it if you would give this video a like and thank you so much.